There's a new way to see what's available when it comes to electric vehicles. Today, Miller Electric Company opened its Electric Vehicle Innovative De Design Center in Jacksonville's South Point area. It's a move many officials say could change transportation. News for Jack's reporter Aaron Farrar was there and shows us why the company says the center is unique, not just to Jacksonville, but the whole United States. This move is being considered opening the door to the future of transportation. Miller Electric Company partnering with several other groups to open an electric vehicle innovation design center. This is going to be public charging. Donnie Smith, who is the company's chief commercial officer, says this is one of a kind because of the access that the public will have. This allows our clients from all over the country to come to Jacksonville and see all the different chargers, makes and models. Our clients are asking us, what, what do you recommend? Well, now we're going to bring them to Jacksonville, Florida, and they're going to get to put their hands on it. They're going to get to test from charging, collecting data, to a training center and a lab for apprentices to learn how to install, maintain, test, and commission these chargers. Many say this is a game changer. It's not just a design center, it's a hub of innovation, a space where ideas transform into reality. In addition to our chargers for cars out here, out in the parking lot, we're also going to have DC charging, which will be for like the JTA buses that are passing through our community. They're going to be able to stop here and charge. We're going to have solar arrays with battery storage. A big part of this hub will be those in the apprenticeship program. 50 people will get to enroll each year to complete a five-year program. And those apprentices can actually build what's behind me. This is called a skid. What's significant about this, the first of its kind was built right here in Jacksonville. This is mobile, so it can be picked up, taken to any other job site in the country. It could be used as an example for those who are building the same kind of charging systems at those job sites. And if there is any money being generated at those sites, it can be picked up and moved to a different location. Miller Electric's CEO, Henry Brown, says this new center is a commitment to a focus on energy, sustainability. Our investment in the EVIDC is not just a testament to our environmental stewardship, but also a reflection of our commitment to invest in the prosperity of Jacksonville. In a way they say will drive the evolution of electric vehicles in the River City. Reporting, I'm Aaron Farrar, Channel 4, The Local Station.